Hello there, I am talking to you through the computer screen right now, and these guys, they ask me to r make video, and they give me scripts, but I I'm, go I'm just gonna tell you a story, okay? And this is it's a story about these guys that call themselves the 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 title mosaic. All right, it's a band. So, all right, so they 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 got together. They're a group of friends in uh, tw 2010 during school year, and um, they tried they tried to make some music that that didn't work too well. They couldn't really get it together, and they wanted to play show. So they're like, hey, how about we come uh, death metal theater and we'll play some some heavier, some turned up versions of some songs from uh, from our high school dinner theater stuff. And yeah, maybe that'd be cool. But you know, it, it well, they didn't get it together and it just didn't work out. So they're like, oh no, what are we gonna do? We want to play the show. So it became what's called the Rock Puss Garden. And with that, one of the guys had some tunes he recorded on his computer, and they, they made no sense, kind of. They tried to play those live along with the track, and it, it just it just didn't work. And they were all, eh, I don't know, but let's let's try to actually write some music. So after that show, uh, one of the guys started showing up less and less, the drummer, and. Uh, so the lead vocalist Nick he uh, he shifted from singing to trying to play the drums a bit and they kept jamming and uh, the rest of the guys in this band that they were now uh, there was Braden on the rhythm guitar and uh, Keenan on the lead guitar and um, Nick well, as I said Nick was on the drums and uh, Sam played the keys the, the piano. And uh, they they all sang. They they all did, did the singing part, and yeah. And then the summer came. Nick bought himself an electronic drum set because before they were just playing playing in the school. And um, they started jamming in his garage, and uh, they got bits and pieces of music all together. Tried to make songs, but. Uh, Nothing really came out of that, and uh, it was all captured by a microphone plugged into a computer, and it sounded like this. Nick had graduated and he was uh, going to university and that was the fall of 2010 and um, the rest of the members they stayed around, they were at school and uh, then the next summer once Nick was back they started uh, jamming again and uh, these, these recordings they were captured on the film, on the video like you can probably be seeing now but uh, this is what it sounded like. <laughs> on the drums, you know, and uh, you know, so he's like, you know what, I, like, I'll purchase a purchase drum set off my neighbor, R really good deal, you know, yeah, and they're like, oh, we can actually be banned, we could, we could play, we could make music, so 
they decided to try to write the first original song and it sounded like this. So after they recorded, they, the, they made the first song, they were like, no, we should think of a name, what, what do we want to be known as? And they, they picked up the name, a title mosaic. Pretty, pretty nice, pretty, pretty cool, kind of, kind of shiny, yeah, shiny name. And so Nick went away again for university the fall 2011. Braden and Sam had graduated, grade 12, all done. So they, they practice and they make, make the red song, and then a few of them. And uh, Keenan continued going to school, and but I guess they, they talked or something, I, I hope, probably. And then uh, in the summer 2012, they, they all came back together to the little garage and uh, started practicing again and they they wrote the second song <laughs> They all in the band, they all like, oh, we all sing, I, I don't know, play an instrument, sing at the same time, kind of, and so they thought that maybe, hey, we should, we should ask Jerobi to be, to be singer, and it happened, so they took two, the two original songs, and they put the cover together pretty quick, and they played a battle of the bands, competition. Wow, and they had a bunch of fun, it was satisfying, get up on stage, damn yeah, it, it was, it, I watched them, pretty pretty nice show, and um, they thought they could have done better, and well, yeah, and so they decided, hey, we should write more songs, we should be, we should become better, write better stuff, and th once, once they're done doing that, they're going to put out the demo disc. This is going, it's going to be good. So, uh, a title mosaic. They, they're a multifaceted rock band from the Flin Flon, Manitoba, Canada, hoping to provide a mixture of friendly, challenging, mellow, loud, and in the end, reflective musics. Okay, I hope you enjoy. The good friends of mine. I do this for favor. Thank you very much. <laughs>